Center. Pals. What is up, everyone? Welcome back. I'm Achara Cook, joined by Kristen Stephenson Pino, my very favorite non Japanese Japanese person. <laughs> and by that, I mean she may not look Japanese, but Kristen grew up in Japan and considers Japan to be one of her many homes. So this will be fun because you're actually going to be able to understand all the Japanese without subtitles, which makes me very jealous. I'm finally excited. <laughs> I'll be up in my alley. You'll be like, yeah, I got hood. this. I got this. Without further ado, let's check out this movie. It's Tom Cruise, baby! They say Japan was made by a sword. They say the old gods tipped a coral blade into the ocean, and when they pulled it out, four perfect drops fell back into the sea, and those drops became the islands of Japan. That's a beautiful story. I say Japan was made by a handful of brave men, warriors and willing women. to give their lives for what seems to have become a forgotten word, honor. Yeah, I feel like honor is like a huge part of the, the Japanese culture and obviously like the whole way of the samurai. Makes sense why I am the way I am. <laughs> <laughs> All the honor. <laughs> Ken Watanabe, one of Hollywood's favorite Japanese men. Whoa. <laughs> Is this a memory? He's handsome. Chara, getting in there. What? I say what I feel. Like I see you. Ladies and gentlemen, Winchester, America's leader in all forms of armament used by the United States Army, celebrates our nation's centennial by bringing you a true American hero. Mm, an alcoholic hero. Winner of the Medal of Honor for his gallantry on the hallowed ground of Gettysburg. He is triumphant campaign against the most savage of the Indian nations. I present Captain Nate Aldrin. Woohoo! He's gonna come in all trash. No, he's not. He's not even gonna come in. Maybe I don't know. This is your last performance. You're fired. Now get out there. Performance. This is the gun that's winning the West. By many's a time, I found myself. Oh, he oh. got the cue card. Surrounded by a swarm of angry hostiles with nothing but this rifle between me and a certain and gruesome death. Oh, is this like an ad from the 1800s? <laughs> this, ladies and gentlemen, the 73 lever action, seven shot capacity, mm -mm. accurate, 400 yards, one round per second. A uh, son, have you ever seen what this could do to a man? Uh, oh my god, he's excited. Well, you could kill yourself five, six, seven braves without ever having to reload. Note the patented loading port and the smooth cocking action. Dude, oh. I'd be so scared. Yeah. He's like, I'm fired anyway. I wow, mean, what a shot. Those are solid shots. I love how this guy's just smiling. <laughs> I know. Enjoying the show. He's like, this is great. Everybody else is like, he's mad. We're going to the little big horn. Says I, what's this wee stuff? It's the walking ticket for me. Nine lives I have. Nine lives I have. <laughs> God knows it looks as if you're going to need one real soon. Yeah. What kind of a job? New job. A man's job. A man's job. Unless, of course, you get your heart set in a career in the theater. Nope. No. What are we doing? What's a man's job? To go fight. Just listen to what your man has to say. I'm a it's been a while. It's yeah. Good to see you. Nathan Algren, I'd like you to meet Mr. Omura from Japan. Put him back in the war. <laughs> and Mr. Omura here is willing to spend what it takes to hire white experts to train their army. We will pay you four hundred dollars a month. Dang. Who will we be training your boys to fight? His name is Katsumoto Moritsu. He was once the emperor's teacher. He's samurai. Oh. You want me to kill Japos? I'll kill Japos. I'm not Japos? asking you to kill. For 500 bucks a month, I'll kill whoever you want. Mm. I keep one thing in mind. I'd happily kill you for free. Mm. Wow. Okay. July 12th, 1876. There is some comfort in the emptiness of the sea. No past, no future. Just the present. And then at once, I am confronted by the hard truth of present circumstances. I have been hired to help suppress the rebellion of yet another tribal leader. Oh, yeah, but he fell in love with the Indian. Oh, maybe. Apparently, this is the only job for which I am suited. Killing. I am beset by the ironies of my life. If he's carrying that, there's no way he really truly feels hate toward them. No, I don't think so. That's the sense I get is that like... he. I think he's he, broken. Yeah, like maybe he learned a lot about their culture mm -hmm. and like befriended them yeah and then he had to kill them for the army <sighs> yeah 
Or where that guy was the one who kind of like, yeah, oh, here we go. Shit on him, and then he's the one who get the order and killed them. Yeah. When he was trying to stop it, maybe. Maybe. Um, but I guess it's like also when you're in the army, you have to follow orders, yeah. even if maybe in your heart you're like, this is wrong. Because it looks like maybe he had to kill yeah. some children and women. Uh, Captain oh, Morgan, I hate I'm this you. guy. Yes. <laughs> oh, Johnny Good, how do you? Sound great. I Why? hate everything he plays in. He's just so, ooh. I think he always plays the same type of character. It's a just weasel? just kind of like snivelly, yeah. He might be a good guy in this one. I came over with a British trade mission, no. Oh years ago, I had a rather unfortunate tendency to tell the truth in a country where no one ever says what they mean. So now oh. I very accurately translate other people's lives. Oh, interesting. No, I feel like, but the Japanese way is, it's okay, fine, maybe you don't say what you mean, but you've got to understand the layers. The Divine Emperor Meiji bids you welcome. He is grateful for the assistance your country offers. He looks young. The Emperor is most interested in your American Indians if you have fought against them in battle. We have, Your Highness. The Emperor wishes to ask Captain Olgren if it is true they wear eagle feathers and paint their faces before going into battle and that they have no fear. Yes. They are very brave. <laughs> he did pretty good. <laughs> he did pretty good on that. That actually kind of makes me like him. July 22nd, 1876. For six months' work, I am to receive three years of captain's pay. Wow. They are an army of conscripts. Most of them are peasants who have never even seen a gun. Fire! Uh. They are led by General Hasegawa, a man of small stature who nonetheless commands enormous respect. He looks respectable. Katsumoto no longer dishonors himself by using firearms, you see. He uses no firearms. You see, to those who honor the old ways, Katsumoto is a hero. Hmm. Uh. Well, the general and Katsumoto fought together for the emperor. He fought with the samurai. He is samurai. Oh. Mm -hmm. Katsumoto pledged his sword to defend oh. the Emperor. They say that the samurai sword is his soul. I need more detailed information to their battle tactics. I have several more books just waiting to be translated. <gasps> Imagine someone who hates you with the utmost intensity, grabbing a handful of your hair while you're lying prostrate and helpless. <laughs> <laughs> Nervous laughter. And scraping a dull blade of a rusty knife around your scalp. Oof. And let your imagination grasp, if you can, Mr. Graham, the effect of a strong, quick jerk oh. on the turf of your hair to release any cleaning particles would have on your nervous system. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay, this guy. Just delighted you're taking such an interest in samurai. I don't give a damn about the samurai. For now. I want to know my enemy. I want to know my enemy. Yeah. Why are you training them if they're your enemy? No, th he has to fight the samurai. Can I get you anything, sir? This is the punitive uh, expedition. Because I think... Captain. Colonel Baggins. Oh, they're it's against like, me. Yeah, yeah. To do with yeah. The race. it would be the Meiji Congrats. Restoration, well, right? Boys. And so samurai, if I remember history correctly, like they're outlawed now or something. Like they're trying to change from the old ways to the new way. Oh. This is so barbaric. Like, they're not even armed. Mm -mm. Katsumoto has attacked the railroad at the border of his province. We cannot govern a country in which we cannot travel freely. He must be stopped now. They're not ready. The rebels mm -hmm. don't have a single rifle. They're savages with bows and arrows. Yeah, but if you can't shoot, don't underestimate them. Like, these men are trained warriors. Okay, fine, you have guns. You might hit someone, yeah. luckily, by accident. Tell this man, if he does not shoot me, I will kill him! Fire! Ute! Ute! <laughs> oh, my god, he closed his eyes. Come on. You want to send these men to their <laughs> death? Yep. He just made a huge point right there. I don't the regiment leaves at 6 a.m. Wow, <sighs> You're a horrible leader. He is, and I don't like the way that he, like, called them savages and, like, completely underestimated them. Yeah. I think that's his pride and that's his downfall. Move into position! Move into position! First company, form a battle line on me! Red Ford Company, form up behind! Fill in on command! It's wild that this wasn't even that long ago. Sergeant Gant, report to the rear and see to the disposition of the supply trains. 
Sergeant Gant, did you hear my order? I did indeed, sir. Good, then Going into obey battle it. with no you. No disrespect intended, sir, but shove it up your ass. <laughs> <laughs> He's going with you, man. Yeah. He's standing right by your side. Load! Loyalty. Load! Yeah. I feel sorry for these guys that are just getting thrown in there just I know. I feel like it's like it's like a game. Like, oh, we'll take our chances. Like, there's more of us, so the odds are higher. Like, yeah, exactly. No, not the, if you have the most, like, the majority of weak men who aren't ready. They're not ready. No, and you're going against like samurais. Yeah, who are like skilled. Dang. Mm. Oh, they look cool. They look amazing. Our guys look like guppies. You gotta use what you learned. <laughs> I'd be like, give me a sword. <laughs> He didn't say shoot. They're scared. Okay. Yeah, that's it. You got rid of your first, your only. You're, they're not within range, and now nope. you just blew your shot. Because they're scared. <laughs> what do you expect? Well, yeah. Yeah, this is chaos. I probably would lay on the floor and play dead. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'd grab a body and be like, it's just hide. <laughs> grab, yeah. grab the blood. <laughs> Put it all over my face. Oh no. Wow. Or I'd fight to the death. I don't know, you know? But if I'm a coward, then <laughs> that's my that's my get out. Get out of jail free. Oh freak. dang. This is just so sad. These men did not just like me to die. I'm just thinking of that, whoever, the general or the other officer who's like, they're just savages with bows and arrows. It's like, yeah, look what their bows and arrows can do. Oh no, is he gonna die? Ooh. Oh, bye. Dang. Got a little cameo and that's it. Oh no. Oh. Uh oh. Whoa. Oh. Uh. Ouch. Horsey. All right. Hey. Whoa. Yo, this guy is so scary. Yeah. Wow. One guy against all those samurai. Uh, uh, oh no. Uh. Oh, still fighting. Impressive. Are you gonna impress him? Wow. Yeah, I think he is. Because he's gonna show you, like, fearless. Yeah. You know, he is, he is hot. Yeah. You, you right. He's like, taking a blow and he's like... Respect, respect. Yeah. Warrior to warrior. I love that he's watching. Like, one guy against what, like, five? Yeah. Where most would probably surrender at that point. Oh, it's his vision from the meditation. Oh. I was wondering if that was he's like the a line. vision. Yeah, yeah for the he's future. the tiger. Yeah. Oh my god, I just got chills. He's the tiger that will help you win. Yeah. Was here. Uh oh. Oh, he's gonna kill him. <laughs> oh. Uh, what? Mate. Okay, maybe he's not gonna say it's not his time. <laughs> yeah, that was it. That's the sign. That's all he needed. <laughs> Sorry, friend. The bamboo bottle. Oh my god! And we've got Hiroyuki Sonata as well. Oh. You were defeated, friend. Can you imagine? <laughs> like you're a white guy and you've never seen this before? Yeah. You didn't know that they do that? No, I do. <laughs> I just, well, I... <gasps> Watching it and knowing is different, Achara. Yeah, okay. well, at least they didn't show the guts coming out, okay? So, yeah. <laughs> oh. Didn't even, didn't even flinch. Looked you in the eye and everything. That was great control, though. Yeah. I would have asked him this. Like, oh, my oh he, he did get him a little yeah. bit. We are deep in the mountains and the winter is coming. You cannot escape. Hmm. 
Jolly good. Jolly good. <laughs> Jolly good. Thank you. Give the man some alcohol and he'll be fine. Ooh. Pretty. Yeah. Oh. You can read all of his private journals. Mm -hmm. It's very invasive, but you'll learn a lot about him. I mean, he did. He learned about him. Smart man. He's very wise. Yeah, can he read? I want it. Of course he can. He's smart. He's smart, but like, can he read English? He, just because you can speak it doesn't mean that you can necessarily read it, you know? <laughs> yep, withdrawals. Yeah. Getting clean. It's gonna be rough. Yep. I'm so glad I never had it. I've never had it. Like, had, had a dependency? Had a, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that, I feel like that would be the worst thing. Sake. Okay. No, no sake no for more. you. Tough love. Sake. You tell him. She said it was such grace. I know. Sweat it out. Oh, oh man. Oh, that's, why, that's why he wants it because he's trying to drown the memories out. Yeah. Sorry. Now honey. you got a deal, bro. Yeah, you just got to go through it. God, she's distractingly beautiful. She's so gorgeous. Beautiful village. Yeah. I miss my home. How do you say white guy? <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. Dainjing. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's not really what, well, it's more of like a foreigner. Oh, no. Oh! You did not! Uh-oh. You got a thing or two to learn about... Oh, I hope she whoops him. ...Asian culture. Disrespect. Oh. Yeah. Achi, go! You! Go! Yeah, she next time, me. take off your shoes. What is your name? See, he speaks English. Oh, my words not correct? Mm. Look, he just wants to practice. Just talk to him. I will practice my English with you. See? <laughs> so cute. If you would honor me. You kept me alive just to speak English? No. What do you want? Then what do you want? To know my enemy. Hmm. I've seen what you do. I've seen what you do to your enemies. The warriors in your country do not kill? They don't cut the heads off defeated kneeling men. Okay. A samurai cannot stand the shame of defeat. I was honored to cut off his head. Respect. Many of our customs mm. seem strange to you, and the same is true of yours. For example, not to introduce yourself is considered extremely rude, even among enemies. <laughs> Nathan Ogren. Okay, there we go. I'm honored to meet you. I have enjoyed this conversation in English. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. I have questions. Questions come later. Who's a warrior in the red armor? My brother-in-law, Hirotaro. And the woman who cares for me? My sister, Hirotaro's wife. I killed her husband? Yeah. It was a good death. Honorable. You! Oh, oh. we're smiling? Mm. Inviting him. Yeah. He was like giving him the stink eye the whole time. Oh, it must be so weird for him. He's like, I killed I yep. this family's dad. Yep. I killed her husband, and now I'm eating look with them. Oh, man. Yeah. That's a cruel, harsh punishment. This little one. <laughs> <gasps> oh, you yield. Okay, watch. He's gonna get schooled by a kid. Oh, oh. coming for ya. Come in!
Oh. He I wonder fight if you? he's like related to the husband or something. No. He said put it down. We're gonna do a rain fight. Let's go. Whoa. Oh, you don't know shit. Haha. -ha. Sorry. I'm confused on who to root for. <laughs> <You're> like, <laughs> Samurai or Gaijin? I don't know. Samurai, always. All right. He wants to learn. Yeah. Oh. oh. Ah. Ouch. Do you yield? This guy's oh. hot too. <laughs> yeah, he is. Ouch, ouch. That was a good nosebleed. She's so hard to read. All Japanese. Yeah, all Japanese. All Japanese. All Japanese. All Japanese. I love it. They it's know like, how to hold their emotions. Yeah. I'm learning this from watching Shogun. Everything is hidden behind layers yep. upon layers upon layers upon layers. <laughs> oh. You are getting your ass whooped, sir. At least this kind of gives her a sense of like how he defeated her husband, you know? Yeah. He never gives up. I thought he was gonna like trip in or something. Respect? Mm -hmm. No? Somewhat. Yeah. I, I give him respect for that. I just realized I've been remiss. Forgive me. I have yet to thank you for looking out for me yesterday. <laughs> That is your job, correct? <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. I can barely walk today. Well done, Bob. <laughs> Bob! You don't mind if I call you Bob, do you? He speaks you know English Bob this once. whole time. <laughs> God, he was ugly as a mule. <laughs> you ladies' man, Bob? I love how he never says anything. He just keeps talking to him. Ujo is teaching you the way of the Japanese sword. <laughs> yes, indeed. Yeah. Lesson learned. Don't you have a rebellion to lead? People in your country do not like conversation. <laughs> he was a lieutenant colonel. His name was Custer. Oh. Custer? No, he wasn't a good general. He was arrogant and foolhardy. And he got massacred because he took a single battalion against 2,000 angry Indians. 2,000 Indians? <laughs> I like this general Custer. <laughs> this is not what we were going for. What are you doing? Why are we having these conversations? What the hell am I doing here? He was ready. Yeah. In spring, the snows will melt and the passes will open. We attack that. Until that time, you are here. Oh. 1876. I continue to live among these unusual people. Mostly, I'm treated with a kind of a mild neglect, as if I were a stray dog or an unwelcome guest. He's probably learning a lot. Everyone smiles and bows. But beneath their courtesy, I detect a deep reservoir of feeling. Yeah. They are an intriguing people. Mm -hmm. From the moment they wake, they devote themselves to the perfection of whatever they pursue. Yep. Everything they do is perfection. It's, it's amazing. Beautiful. I love the culture. I have never seen such discipline. Mm. I could use some of that. I predict that by the end of this, he will give him respect. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, you're not bad. Oh. <laughs> I, love how he, I love how he smirks. Yeah, try some some clothes. Why not? See what it's all about. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you think they're pretty cool, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know when you start doing that and trying to be them, you know you know they're cool. Smooth. <laughs> Oh. Better? Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Did it work? <laughs> Take that. Take that. What was he going to say? Arigato. Okawari? Oh. Oh, I heard it. Let's talk more. Hashi. はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。はい、はい、はい。は
He learned your name first. Yeah. Oh. How much does he understand? Not much yet. Re you can read the body language for sure. <laughs> he knows that she is not a fan. Oh, for sure. She's been very kind to me. Mm -hmm. She's honored to have my guest in her house. Uh, kind of not really. Mm. I love the movements. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh, this is so beautiful. Oh. I love it. What does it mean to be samurai? In the snow. The way of the sword. Mueru. <laughs> 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 Mueru. Mueru. to burn. Mueru. 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 Oh, we're warming up to him, are we? <laughs> he understood! <laughs> He's like, all right, listen, you got your customs, we got ours. It's like, I'm not Japanese. I'm a gentleman, I'm gonna help a lady. At some point, he's gotta say sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Come in the side. I'm gonna. For your husband, Hirotaro. That person was. I'm gonna. 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 I wish you could understand in Japanese. No, no, get it. no, no, not me. You gotta get the ball. You gotta get the ball. The ball. I imagine maybe the samurai men don't play with the children like that. Mm-mm. Nah, no, not this time. Go to the. Ha! Impa. Five, six, seven, Woo! eight moves. <laughs> oh, wait, it's a three? They're oh, okay, well, I don't know. <clears throat> I guess, what do I know? Look at it. Oh, oh. <laughs> Dang. All right. God, you're losing money, sir. <laughs> For your mind. Okay, there we go. Quiet your mind. I love his shots. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, coming for ya! Oh, dang! No, no, no! Oh, what? Ah! You okay? I'm okay with his draw. I just didn't want him to beat him, though. Yeah, that's improvement. Huge. He's like, what just happened? Bow. Respect. Well done. He was he was happy. He's impressed. Yeah, with yeah. That. He's like, yeah. I'm a good teacher. <laughs> <laughs> this little one. You know, he's his face is so squishy. Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> he's making an appearance. Uh oh. Oh, don't do this to us right now. Is someone coming? Oh, oh no, ninjas! No. <gasps> <gasps> oh, my heart. I don't. <laughs> Uh, that's a whole different fighting style from the samurai. I'm not ready for this. I thought she looked up. Maybe she saw something. Oh, you're just looking at her. That's it. Oh, We're done. Oh, no. He sees it. He sees it. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Come on. You're going to prove your worth. Tell him to duck down. Take take the hit for him. I don't know. Katsumoto! Uh-oh. How many ninja? This is wrong. This is so wrong on so many different levels. Oh. Oh, yeah. oh this is brutal. I'm so oh, sad. No, right no, now. no, no. Dang. Oh, God. Please don't die. Whoa. Oh. There we go. Protect the children and the mummy. Get a sword. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Whoa. Get it, girlfriend. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, my God. No, baby. Oh, 
are you going to give him his father's sword? My... Oh. No, no, no! No, 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 no! He's just little! All right. No! Oh, my God. Oh, thank God. I was about to lose my damn mind and cry. Oh, my God. Ugh. All right. Buddies, let's go. You have seen many things. I have. Mm -hmm. You do not fear death. But sometimes you wish for it. Is this wow. not so? He knows you. It happens to men who have seen what we have seen. And then I come to this place of my ancestor. I never remember like this ourselves. We are all dying. Yeah, you're not wrong. The Emperor has granted a safe passage to Tokyo. We leave tomorrow. Wow, just like that. Good. Good. When I took this, you were my enemy. <gasps> oh, now you're my friend. This film. That was a beautiful shot. Made more beautiful by a beautiful lady. I think that's rude. Yeah, why are you feel a little invaded? You just can't come up on a girl yeah, like that when she's bathing. That's basically her undergarments, right? The yeah. white layer. He can us. <laughs> does not say I must go. He says that ikimasu, which means I go. <laughs> she understood. He just said, won't forget. Oh, she's gonna miss you. Yeah, she caught feelings. Can you blame her, really? Mm, what is it? Thanks, buddy. He's probably afraid. I mean, there's no guarantee that he would come back, right? Just like, lost another father figure. And the journey begins. Again. You know what's kind of cool is he went from being with the Indians to the Japanese. Yeah. That's a really cool, like, combo. I think there's lots of stuff in the culture that are maybe quite similar. <laughs> similar and yet so different. I love it. Yeah. Uh-oh. Quick, turn the camera around. Take a picture of the samurai. I suppose it would be super blurry, though, because you can't move. <laughs> yeah, you... He's scared now? Look who they have. <laughs> Look at them. I bet he's scared that he trained them, but in reality, they trained him. And like his face as well. He's got like the same Except fierce for... but serene face. Yeah. But not only that, he's like clean now. Bow. Yes. No head nod, nothing. No. Come on now. Oh, they've trained them. Oh, they know their shit now. As soon as the Emperor signs the damn trade agreement, he gets the whole package. Including this particular item. 200 rounds a minute. Wow. I need a bath. After living with those savages, I can only imagine. You're gross. You're rude, disgusting. Wow. No pressure. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Dang. He's that's just, pretty. He's, that's any other person would take an advantage of that. Yeah. That situation. If Katsumoto is allowed to attract other samurai to his cause, we will have ten years of rebellion. Either I will stop him at the council today, or you will lead my army against him. Oh no. I appreciate the offer. It is not an offer. Oh. Do we understand each other? Uh. Say yes, yes we each other perfectly. but don't do it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Captain Ogren. <laughs> oh, they don't know you. No, 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 no. No, 
No! No! no you, oh, oh, man. <laughs> Why are you guys so ugly and evil and just... Oh, they just took away his honor. Mm. Mm -hmm. oh, is he gonna... Yeah. Ooh. Emperor, back him up. Come on, man. He was weak, that's why. You needed to tell him. Come on, man, don't be weak. They got to him. He's scared. <sighs> it's like all of them against this one guy. Come on, boy. Wake up. Mm. He's surrounded by wolves. He should have given him that advice when he needed it most. Yeah. And I get he ha you know, he's like wants it to be from pureness, but. Katsumoto's under arrest. Amura won't let him last the night. And with Katsumoto dead, we should have little trouble handling what's left of the rebellion, even without you. Wow. Save us the trouble. I wonder if he already knows that he's being followed. Oh, here we go. Dive. Nice. Wow. Oh, who you are did you? it. Who are you? Oh, we get to watch it again. Like, he didn't even look scared. He was, like, so calm. Like, what a difference from the earlier scene where he was up against five samurai. Yep. And he was, like, really desperate. You know it. You can feel it. Mm-hmm. Oh. Uh-oh. You're finished. Ah! Oh. Dang! Dang! Yeah, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. <laughs> he's like, Ooh. keep moving, keep moving. Oh, he's pushing him. <laughs> yeah, just act like you belong. We're meant to be here. It's all Good about job. confidence. I know. President of the United States. Sorry. <laughs> I think that made him sick. <laughs> he got nervous. He got nervous, so he lied too big. <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> I think I made a mistake. <laughs> I really like him in this. Yeah. I decided to stay. See if I could convince you to escape. <sighs> How do you plan to do that? Ha! Ah! Are you sure? Yes! Woo! Let's go. Mr. Graham? Let's go, son. Perhaps you would care to take pictures of my village. I would be greatly honored. Wow. I hope we don't lose any more lives today. Uh oh, whoa. Come on, get out of there. Sword versus gun. Oh no. They say don't bring a knife to a gunfight, but. I mean, if you're a samurai. There we go. Yeah. They're all like, Who said Asians aren't hot? They, they were wrong. Like, they're wrong, man. I still want to hear this guy speak. Come on, Gramps. Oh no, don't kill Gramps. Oh, no. Not him, not him, not, no, not no, the no, young no, one. No, 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 no! Oh, shit. Oh no, his son. He's going to save him. Please save him. Come on. Save him! Save him. Sorry, I'm screaming. No man left behind. Let's go. Yep. Oh no. Oh. Dude, he could, if he could do that, maybe they could have saved him. He's giving everything. Oh my god. Oh man. So young as well. The way of the samurai is not necessary anymore. What could be more 
necessary. I will die by the sword, my own. Or my enemies. So which one is it? Let it be your enemies. Together, we will make the Emperor hear you. With violence? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Charma. <laughs> You're too cute. Like, stop. <laughs> You're so like, it's like, like, what is the plan here? He told us that. Oh, oh no. Mm -hmm. I yeah. He's angry because he loves you. Yeah. There's many layers to that. <laughs> they don't hug in Japan. That, that. I, bet, I bet he needed that little hug, though. Mm -hmm. How many men will we have? Maybe 500. Like General Custer. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> that mad man. Him and this General Custer, he's so obsessive. A battle in a place called Thermopylae. 300 brave Greeks held oh, off yeah. the Persian army of a million men. A million, you understand this number? <laughs> I understand this number. You understand this number. For two days, the Greeks made them pay so dearly, the Persian army lost all taste for battle and were defeated soon after. What do you have in mind? Take away the advantage of their guns. We're overconfident we use that. Yeah. Lure them close. Then we take them down. You believe a man can change his destiny? I think a man <laughs> does what he can. That's the American way. <laughs> yeah, always. Until his destiny is revealed. Hmm, this is different. Naruto. This will be the last entry in this journey. I do not presume to understand the course of my Lady life. Here. I know I am grateful to have partaken of all this. Oh my god, let's take a picture of everyone. So fierce. Yeah, do what you have to do before battle. Mm hmm. Make peace. Oh my gosh. Oh, I should we give her a husband's uniform? Oh my god. Or his, uh, his armor. armor. How many times has she done this for her husband? You know, like putting, getting him ready for battle, right? I was, I wasn't talking about sexy times. <laughs> I know, but like she's doing it for the man that killed her husband. Let's say he might be the man that can save her. Yeah, but you know how hard that would be. Yeah, putting you knowing those, like the last person who wore those, were your husband. Yeah, like I hope this yep. protects you better than it protected him. Just saying. And try out your comments. I'm sorry. Killing me. Sorry. Oh my god. <gasps> oh. Oh. That hurt oh. her feelings. Maybe. I don't know. What do we got? Ooh. What does it say? Oh. Wow. Okay. <laughs> You're a samurai now, baby. But he's not used to fighting in that kind of armor. That's true, actually. He's he's used to fighting something lighter. More loose, yeah. So I'm wondering. <laughs> yep. Do these costumes are fire? Oh, he made it for him. You will need this. What does it say, though? What does it say? I belong to the warrior in whom the old ways have joined the new. Ooh. It's great honor. All right, guys, home turf. Oh, they are ready. If you and your fellows lay down your arms, you will not be harmed. Mm. This is not possible. Yeah, as no. As Mr. Omelan knows. Ha! <laughs> we will show you no quarter. You ride against us, and you are the same as they are. Yeah. I'll look for you on the field. Ooh! Ah! Them's fighting words. Let's go. Ah! Hiroyuki Sonata's a badass. Mm-hmm. Ah! Oh no, this is gonna hit. Like you knew it was gonna hit though. Oh. 
phase one complete. They're covering their retreat. Uh, See, so, even okay, the okay. mighty samurai cannot stand up to the howitzers. Okay, they wanted to yeah, yeah. distract them. Oh, that was the plan. Get them close. Yep. All right, phase two. We gotta get them close, but we also have to destroy the the canyons. The cannons? Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> it's our third language, guys. Wait for the volley. Oof. They're gonna yeah, lose some men, for sure. Because their first shot, they gotta reload. Then second line. Second line. Oh. Here we go. Whoa. Okay. Smart. How do you like that? That was clever. I would want right. to know that my arrow got someone and didn't miss. Yeah. What happened to the warriors at Thermopylae? Dead to the last man. They all man. died. <laughs> Dead to the last man. Yeah. He says. And then he just starts laughing. He's like, I gotta know the story yeah. before I go. Yeah. Just in case. They all died, but they fought really, really well. The last, they and, fought till the last man. And they, they saved Sparta, so. Oh. Oh, no, no. That's his job, to always protect him, watch over him. Yeah. He said his first words. Yeah. <gasps> no! This is so cheap. Oh, we got more. Oh, there we go. Our, our horses are now coming. Let's go. I feel like I need a horse. Oh, let's go, Chara! <laughs> oh. Dang, the music, the score. Oh, Get it, Hiroyuki, let's go! Wow. Oh my goodness. How many people did they have in that shot? That's crazy. Retreat, retreat. Son of a bitch thinks he can win. <laughs> well, yeah. Oh, no, no! no! Oh. This is breaking me. Hurt me in there, Kristen. I don't like war. I don't like watching people die. No. Hogekyoi! Come on! This is madness. Yeah. He's going to attack? Yes. Dang it. They're just gonna get blown to pieces. And they're going slow. Good. Oh, there we Pick go. Pick up Picking speed. It up. There we go. What are you guys gonna do? Woo! Right at the front. Hey, chicken? You, you see how many people they have? You're that scared you're gonna do yeah, that for the canyon? Can't fight normal? Damn, look, this guy's still no. going! <gasps> Fire! It's interesting how um, this guy over here was like, he has to, he's, he's going against all their laws, you yeah. know? And yet he wants to stick to that one. And be like, no, you have to, you have to accept your oh, defeat. No. You know. Mm. Uh, he's gone. Oh. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Yeah, he got you. Yep. With his special sword. We just need to get that guy. Yeah. Oh no, oh, we need to get rid of those. Oh no, not these ones. Oh no. Oh no. That's not... Oh man.
friend. Oh man. Get up. Even this guy is like, <sighs> doesn't feel good about what they're doing. No. Stop. Yeah, you got him. You got him. You have your honor again. Let me die with mine. Mm. He finally understands. Let me up. I don't want you to do it. I will miss our conversations. Oh. Wow. Perfect. There. Come on, you have to respect. <laughs> I need to blow my nose. <laughs> Even if I lift my mic, yeah. I feel like it's gonna be so loud. <laughs> the signing of this treaty will usher in an era of unprecedented prosperity and cooperation between our two great nations. On behalf of the Oh, who? The, the last samurai. This last samurai? Oh. Oh, he's gonna do it again. This is Katsumoto's sword. He would have wanted you to have it. Let the strength of the samurai be with you always. Katsumoto no shio itta mu kimochi wa mina onachi desu. Shikashi nagara. He hoped with his last breath that you would remember the ancestors who held this sword and what they died for. Hiko! No. Oh. You were with him at the end. Emperor, this man fought against you. If you believe me to be your enemy, command me, and I will gladly take my life. Wow. Oh. Do you hear him this time? He said the exact same words. Yeah. I have dreamed of a unified Japan, of a country strong and independent and modern. We have Railroads and cannon, western clothing. We cannot forget who we are or where we come from. Why is it always up to death? Ambassador Swanbeck. Right? For people to like realize things. That your treaty is not in the best interest of my people. If I may, so sorry. But you may not. Oh. Is an outrage. Whatever, shuffle on. Hiko, Yeah, where were you this whole time, Emperor? Tell me how he died. Uh. I will tell you 
How he lived. How yeah. he lived. Oh, you got wise. Mm-hmm. I'm like going off of everything we've learned. <laughs> <laughs> everything we learned through this film. Nations like men, it is sometimes said, have their own destiny. As for the American captain, no one knows what became of him. Well, he lived out the rest of his days in Japan. He may have at last found some small measure of peace that we all seek and few of us ever find. That's an intense statement right there. Hmm. Jamie, the... keep training the youth. <laughs> Oy, was, a lot to take in. Yeah, that was <laughs> intense. That was so beautiful. It was really beautiful. And sad. <laughs> yeah. How how crazy is it that out of all the people in the village, they chose her to look after the one that killed her husband. I feel like there's like healing in that and it takes a lot of strength. It does and take a like, lot of strength. It's almost like it makes things even more painful, but I feel like it's kind of like wise because, you know, normally we're driven by like anger and hate. But when you get assigned basically, right, to somebody who has damaged you or hurt you in some type of way and you get to know them and they get to see you and their place in that position as well yeah. to see what they've taken away from this this, you know, he, he got to see the what he took away from this family, a husband, a father, you know, and that also, I feel like, killed him as well when he yeah, see them. Absolutely. You know, it was like both ways, but then they both ended up getting to know each other and saw past that, the anger and like the sorrow to, and, and, yeah. and got something good out of it, which is, I think is also very, that's strong. That's powerful, and I think it's very beautiful. I'm going to oh. counter that with the practical side, yeah, which is <laughs> she was uh, she was the, the leader's uh, she was the leader's sister, and yes. therefore it made the most sense to assign the task to her and keep keep him close. And I think also maybe in a way it was to give her a sense of purpose because like she said uh, in the movie, she's like, you know, let me take my own life. Yeah. You know, like, and so, but he gave her a sense of purpose. It's like, no, you can't. You have to do this thing that I'm entrusting yeah. you to do. So you got to stay and you got to figure it out. Yeah. You know, toughen up and, and get it done. But yeah, I, I really enjoyed this movie. I love the story. You know, I, I love, I think I kind of, really like the foreigner learns about another culture I and love then it kind too. of becomes a part of that culture and accepts that culture in a way that they maybe do not accept their own. I think that's really beautiful and perhaps my own personal history kind of plays into that a bit because, you know, I'm mixed race. And so yeah. in my own personal life, there is always that kind of mixing and weaving of different cultures. And so it's just always really fascinating and deeply fulfilling for me to see something like this where, you know, white guy comes along, learns the way and is like, I accept the way, you know? Yeah. <laughs> No, I feel like it always feels good when you when you have somebody who isn't very cultured yeah. become, you know, become start to become cultured and understand things and see the differences and how good they can be. Yeah. And then also, I mean, in a way, like mm -hmm. they, they learn from each other, mm -hmm. right? And and that was also really symbolic in the name of his sword, which is like he is the samurai who brings the new ways. So yes. he's a part of the old way and he, he embraces the old way, but also he's bringing them the new. But it was just so fascinating to see his journey from the very beginning of the movie where he it's almost like he doesn't have much to live for. Yep. He's a broken shell of a man no purpose. And with no purpose and he doesn't understand their culture at all. He is completely appalled by the tradition of seppuku and then by the end he helps his friend to to take his own yep. life because he understands yep. finally the honor of what that means to him. You know, yeah. even though he might not fully agree with it, He's like, I get it. I get I it. I respect I it. I respect it. So you yep. do you, I'm going to do me, you know? 
Mm -hmm. Oh, man. That was a lot. It's a stunning this was movie. Done. It was. I feel like the dialogue in it is just absolutely outstanding. Like, Japan in itself is just a deep... Like, they're deep in general. Yeah. They're very deep. They're very wise. And they hold themselves very well. And they're all about the grace and about being, mm -hmm. you know... Like, they'll pick something, whether that's pouring tea. Something is so simple as pouring tea. Yeah. And they perfect it. You know what I mean? And I, I, and I think that's so beautiful, especially when you travel around. Like, I mean, you've traveled a lot, just like me. Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, like, even when you go to Europe, things are different. And then coming to the U.S., like, because you came to the U.S. later in life as well, right? Correct, yeah. Okay, even though your dad was American, but I feel no, like... he's English. Oh, I mean English, sorry. Yeah. That's right. Okay, so you you also see probably see things a lot like I do. Yeah. Like when you first came to America, were you a little bit like put off on some things? I definitely experienced culture shock, which was surprising to me because I was like, I just came from an English speaking country to another English speaking country and Very like, different. it couldn't be more different, you know? Yep. So yeah, definitely relate. Because I came from Japan to the to you at to the U.S. for the first time ever, yeah. and I didn't speak English. Like I had it took the why Sometimes you know, I struggle. <laughs> so, but I have no accent. Okay? Right. I have no accent in English. But my mentality and when I'm thinking things through, it just doesn't come out as smoothly or as clear as I'd like. But you wouldn't know that by just looking at me. Sure. So I always tell people my inside, like. I always say in Japanese, I'm like, nakagawa, ano, nihonjin nakedo, sotokawa ga merika jin, right? So, which means like, I'm, on the inside, you wouldn't see this, but I'm very Asian. I'm yeah. very like, very, ja I'm Japanese on the inside. But on the outside, I'm an American. Right. You know, and other, but other than that, you wouldn't, you wouldn't know unless you knew my story. Right. When I came to the US, it was beyond like the culture shock like was on another level like yeah I, when it I came bet. to like portion sizes the, the way things look the way people behaved you know because i grew up following certain rules in japan and you you know they're you're more trusted also in the um in school with certain things mm -hmm. that you're not trusted with here in the american schools and they're just a little bit more like respectful and very like it's done this way. Yeah. You know, we go from like cleaning our schools to cooking our own meals, serving it to, a, you know, and cleaning it up again. We're here. It's, you have adults constantly doing, doing these things you, yeah. for you. It was interesting because at my age, I was way ahead of the people yeah. who I was supposed to be with. Mm -hmm. You know, and I'm sure you probably felt that as well when you came here, because even when you're in Europe, they're also ahead, I feel like. Yeah, yeah, definitely, in definitely ways. had that, yeah. But even, like, just the mannerisms and, like, I, it took me a long time. Like, I used to, any time I said sorry or, or hello, like, I would always do this. And people used to make fun of me for the longest time. It took, like, maybe, like, seven, eight years or so for me to, like, knock it off. <laughs> Not bow every <laughs> time like, oh, hello. Yeah, or I'm like, oh, I'm so sorry. Like, oh, I'm so, oh, hello, you know. And they're like, why do you always do this? And I'm like, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm like, why am I doing this? And I'm like, well, it, because it's my sign of respecting you, you know. Yeah. And people didn't understand that. But also when I would take off my shoes, um, it took a lot for me to keep them on. In, in someone's house. In someone's house. Yeah. And I think it finally kicked in because I got tired of soiling my socks into people's <laughs> homes. <laughs> and I was like, I'm tired of my socks getting dirty because I take them off. And then I'm like, okay, they don't do that here. <laughs> Only yeah. certain places. I mean, it's a it's a big adjustment anytime yeah. you're moving to a different country and you're, you're learning the culture. But I, like, I think that they did this really well in the movie where like... We're learning as mm -hmm. he's learning. I've always had a deep appreciation for Japanese culture. Um, and, you know, I'm not Japanese, but in school and stuff, it, whenever I was given the opportunity to do research projects, I always would try and do one on like Japan or like theater in Japan or just because I've always been fascinated because of the things that you talked about in the Japanese culture, like it's the beauty, different. the grace, the the discipline, um, the philosophy, everything like that. And I think that the movie really balanced mm -hmm. just kind of the the brutality of war that we see, yeah. but then also just the deep appreciation of the present moment of life and of beauty that is just such a deep part of the Japanese culture. I yeah. think, you know, and so 
Yeah, it was just like a, a, a really interesting film. Although watching it now, like over 20 years after it came out, and you know how like just attitudes have changed. There were certain things where I was like, yeah, I could see how like maybe watching it now, some people might be like, oh, there's the, there's that whole like white savior complex that we've got here. It's like, okay, fine. He's he's a white guy that like I hate when people think like that shows personally. the way to I mean I think it's a valid story is what I'm trying to say it's mm -hmm. like it's a valid story and we can take it as it's a story and if it's working to make people interested in Japan and Japanese culture in a positive way then I feel like it's doing its job you know yeah because everything is a story and even now like we're watching shogun which is an amazing show but they they kind of show a little bit more of the brutality of the samurai mm -hmm. whereas here we're very much presented with the noble samurai right like like all mm -hmm. of the the good things because obviously our our main character right he is the epitome of what like the 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 strongest values of a samurai are you know yeah and so i think that's valid uh, equally as valid as a story that someone wants to tell where they show more of the brutality of the samurai who maybe weren't so noble who went around like killing peasants and stuff like that also fair but i like it that in this story we get the version where it's like these guys are badasses and they're heroes and they're <laughs> out here like their their goal is to to do what they think is right for the country even yes. though i know during history like this was a time of great change for yeah. japan where they where they went from like we have samurai to like no it's the meiji restoration and now we're like advancing forward and you really feel that in the movie like oh, the, the tipping point and that's always hard to do that make that change and that shift because you're going from something that's you're the the old way I, yeah. I, there's something there's something always great about the old ways yeah and then there's always something that's new and exciting about the new but i'm that person that even with technology today i'm not the biggest fan of it um i guess i understand there's great things that come from it and i'm like oh that's actually really cool but at the same time i struggle myself yeah with that change yeah into it because i feel like man we're gonna lose this though and this is the beauty of the simplicity and like the just being in the moment and with nature and you're taking it away and i struggle with that yeah you know and i feel like this i i don't like any culture could watch this film and feel that yeah you know, and feel that that struggle with the the old and the new because a lot of people don't find that happy medium ground they just go full blast yeah. like one way or the or, or the other and it's scary going going the new routes is very very scary change is scary it is scary yeah sometimes it's exciting and other times it's like you know, sometimes it's like we take 10 steps forward and then 20 back because it actually didn't work. And then there's other times where it's like, actually, you know, no, that was the best thing that ever happened. Right. Kind of like if you go back to when we were in school and your teachers are like, oh, you won't have a calculator with you all the time. It's like, yeah, ha, ha. I <laughs> yeah, I do. I suck it. Like, you know, and like, and that's like, that's the best thing in the world. But at the same time, if my phone goes to crap, <laughs> right, then yeah. I will be okay. But the majority of like our new youth would not. True. You true. know what I mean? So there's, there's certain things that we're kind of like, we're like, we think it's great. Yes. But at the same time, I almost feel like you still need to learn the old with the new so that you don't have to rely so much on certain things that like for example their guns like then the machine guns exactly. stuff like that it becomes like okay a crutch. what exactly so it's like the odds are that none of those men truly like if we go from the beginning of the film none of them know how to fight they're just learning how to basically shoot a gun exactly. and kill something with some with, without even getting their hands fully dirty and like throwing themselves out there where the other guys no matter what you know, their mentality is a little bit different because they're confident in themselves to defend Whoa. themselves and like yeah. to fight, but also they're not using uh, like, yeah. yeah. It's completely different being able to take a life from several paces away, yes. from far away, rather than 
being able to take a life and look at front, in, yeah. in the eyes of the man and that you're killing. You know, like it's mm-hmm. it's a different thing. And I, I personally feel like if you're gonna do that, that's how it should be. It shouldn't be from afar. I think that's cowardly. That's just my opinion. Unfortunately, that's the way. That's the I way. I know, but do you not think it's cowardly? It's, I think it's cowardly. Like you don't even give anybody a chance. Like I'm all about fairness. I get so mad watching this stuff because like it's not fair. You're a and samurai I know, at home. And I know that the, I know life's not fair, you guys. I know it's not fair. However, if I'm going to get in a fight, I want it to be fair. Like I used to go in school and my sister would be in fights all the time. And if I was watching it, it was one on one. I'd be like, all right, cool. I'm not going to intervene. If she right. gets her butt beat, she gets her butt beat. It's fair. OK, uh-huh. there was one time this girl came from behind and I jumped in because I was like, it's not fair anymore. <laughs> and I will jump in. I'm all about fairness. So I struggle with that. Uh, yeah. No, uh, this, is, this was this was a really great film. It's amazing. It's stunningly done. The costumes, the set design. I thought that the, the sceneries they had were just. Uh, yeah. And the way that they they showed just kind of the chaos of war, it it's oh, just yeah. it's very intense. And then with the music, that last battle with the score where it was like perfectly done to the music, like you feel it rise mm-hmm. as they're like, you know, winning, but then like it it, it goes another way when they, it looks like they're starting to lose. It was just so well orchestrated. Hans Zimmer really is was. a genius. Um, yeah, overall, and amazing all the characters film. are just you couldn't help even the ones that are butt heads, you could not help but like, you know, like on the samurai side anyways, you could not help but love them even though like there was never like some of them had never had like that that niceness, but they're just like talking shit the whole time, but you're like, ha ah, I love you. Or even the fact <laughs> that they didn't really say too much. Yes, but like you didn't we, need it. We knew exactly which ones were which, like who yeah. was who, you know, yep. which was fantastic. So really, really well done. It holds up really well, I think. So you guys let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. I'm Achara Kirk. This is Chris and Stavis Pino. I'm going to go blow my nose. Hi. See ya.